so I've just uh, been involved in the in the dress rehearsal today, which is our second uh, our second dress rehearsal, having also been involved in the last one. I think it's gone really well. I think that the whole event has been really well organised. Uh, the the catch up sessions have been really good. Um, the work stream leads and PMOs have offered really good support. Um, uh, there's been a really good example of teamwork from uh, pharmacists to ward clerks to doctors and nurses. I think overall it's it's gone very well. It's certainly raised a lot of issues. Uh, it, it's I think highlighted how how long it takes to do a lot of these things while we're on a steep learning curve. And I think we need to bring that forward with us uh, when come go live, that these things will initially take uh, a long time. And what we found during the day is that all the tasks started becoming much, much quicker to do, much easier to do. We just got much slicker at doing them. We knew where the areas, the critical areas of mistakes uh, are coming from and, and we, we adjusted for them. So I think that we gradually improved uh, as the day progressed. So in that point, it's been a very educational experience. I think that the other thing that's come up, in general, the feedback has been very positive, not just from people involved in the dress rehearsal, but also from, uh, from people looking in from the outside and seeing, seeing what, uh, what it is we are, we are doing. Uh, I think in cardiology in particular, uh, we are uh, in a very fortunate position. We have got excellent staff engagement because, not least because we have several digital digital champions who have been uh, brilliant at their work at engaging uh, our nurses and doctors and, and also uh, trying to 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 integrate uh, unity into our already existing very good digital uh, uh, bits of software.